Secretary you know, Clinton. We will have secure borders, but we will also have reform. And this used to be a bipartisan issue. Ronald Reagan Se was Secretary the last Clinton. president Excuse to me. sign uh, immigration reform, and George W. Bush supported it as well. Secretary Clinton, I want to clear up your position on this issue because in a speech you gave to a Brazilian bank for which you were paid $225,000, we've learned from the WikiLeaks that you said this, and I want to quote, my dream is a hemispheric common market with open trade and open borders. So that's Thank the you. question. <laughs> that's the question. Please quiet, everybody. Is that your dream, open borders? Well, if you went on to read the rest of the sentence, I was talking about uh, energy. You know, we trade more energy with our neighbors than we trade with the rest of the world combined. And I do want us to have a, an electric grid, an energy system that crosses borders. I think that would be a great benefit to us. But you are uh, very clearly uh, quoting from WikiLeaks. And what's really important about WikiLeaks is that the Russian government has engaged in espionage against Americans. They have hacked American uh, websites, American accounts of private people, of institutions. Then they have given that information to WikiLeaks for the purpose of putting it on the internet. This has come from the highest levels of the Russian government, clearly from Putin himself, in an effort, as 17 of our intelligence agencies have confirmed, to influence our election. So I actually think the most important question of this evening, Chris, is finally, will Donald Trump admit and condemn that the Russians are doing this and make it clear that he will not have the help of Putin in this election, that he rejects Russian espionage against Americans, which he uh, actually encouraged in the past. Those are the questions we need answered. We've never had anything like this happen in well, any of our elections before. Uh, 